Security of electricity supply. It sounds technical, but it is simply about keeping the lights on. The Committee for Enterprise Trade and Investment has conducted a review into the security of electricity supply. We sat down with the chairperson of the committee, Patsy McGlone, to find out why the committee initiated the review. There are major concerns being voiced to us from within the industry and indeed people who have expertise in this field that we literally the lights could go out in the north and that is a major, major issue of concern for us all, for domestic consumers and for business alike. We can't afford if that happen. One of the key issues emerging from the committee's evidence gathering was an issue of surplus margin. The surplus is the amount which is currently at any one given time available for, for use in electricity appliances, electric appliances, business and our houses. It seems that a figure for the surplus margin of electricity is not known. Well, the committee found a number of issues, particularly around the security of supply, that it appeared, while it appeared that there was an issue, no one could actually tell us what the surplus was. Interconnection for electricity also arose as a main issue during the review. During the course of the committee hearings, we did hear from NIE that they had a couple of interconnectors, one at Enniskiln and one coming through from Letterkenny. But again, we have to find out what the capacity of those is if, in the interim, they can provide us with some feed into the north from the rest of the island, some electricity feed, mm -hmm. uh, of what their capacity is, how that can help out, how that can support us. The committee made a number of recommendations at the end of the review, and now it is over to the appropriate bodies to consider them and put them into effect. A lot of those issues are out with the department and out with the committee for the lay in the hands of the investors and the electricity and Sony, the supplier networks. For us it is to highlight the issues, to try and gather up as much factual information as is possible, which should inform the department, should inform policy makers and should help us as politicians as we try and uh, paddle our way through many of these issues that for us are very technical and require some expertise along the way in. But the end of this review is just the beginning of a new one for the committee. The committee will now commence part two of the review, which will focus on electricity pricing. Part two is around the pricing uh, costs of electricity, where we're, we're hearing uh, both from, well clearly from consumers, particularly many people who are affected by fuel poverty, who have to make choices between whether they heat or eat, literally, in their homes. And thank God, so far this year, the winter hasn't been too bad. The weather hasn't been too bad to put extra pressures on people. To find out more about the committee's review into security of electricity supply, visit the committee's webpage on the Assembly's website. You can also find out more about the committee's current review on electricity pricing on the webpage as well.